Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So today I'm just going to simply be talking about um, just kind of what's going through my head on recent events. Recent events kind of showcase a lot of different um, circumstances, I guess you could say. Work has been very hectic as of late, and I'm not particularly talking about the things that I've talked about recently as far as like my day shift, my day job goes. Working on the current stuff that I've been trying to focus on is becoming very hard. And the reason for this is actually because of a factor on the platform. Um, and it's actually got to do with the different licenses. Bear in mind, before I go any further, I do understand the purpose of the licenses, and it makes sense. But it also makes some things very difficult to do. I feel like that's an understatement. Like I spoke to you guys about recently, we are in the works of trying to finalize um, our top 10 D9 beats. However, we are stuck in a conundrum, and part of that conundrum actually has to do with that. We want to use D9 beats, his beats for this kind of stuff, but unfortunately the way YouTube's algorithm works is based off the license that he has doesn't allow anybody else to do it. A lot of people space this out. And it's just... upsetting. It's... irritating as well. But it is what it is, and it's something we gotta work around. I guess just it's a short little vent video, um, just kind of letting keep you guys posted again on the whole top 10 D9 beats thing. We do want to get that through, and we do want to make it good quality, but right now it's very difficult because of that aspect, because of these licenses. Now for those of you who are just users, you don't know what the impact of the different licenses are, there are two of them. First of all, there's the... Creative Commons license, which is the secondary one, it's the one that is optional, but YouTube's default is a standard YouTube license. When you have a standard one, you're actually protected and all your content, if shown by anybody else, can get copyright claimed for your sake. If it's a Creative Commons account, you're basically agreeing, consenting to anybody else using the type of content that you present, for example, music. If you create beats and you have a Creative uh, Commons account, you're allowing others to use their beat, your beats in the background. Um, you can still claim them, but because of that Creative Commons, it makes it a bit more freelance. It's same concept with anything else, any other kind of content. And now there are some exceptions because of how broken YouTube is, but... It's hit and miss whether that happens or not. It's still stupid, though. I don't like it. It's like the one thing I don't like about the platform. I've never liked it about the platform. It's always been this way, always will. And it's just, it just sucks. But hopefully we can worm our way around it. Sorry about the little vent, guys, today. That's going to be all. I just kind of wanted to get that thought off my chest, I guess. Thanks for tuning in the video, guys. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.